I'll tell you exactly what's going on in that picture right there. That's a man and his wife. And he said, what do you want to eat? And she was like, I don't care. I'll take anything. And he was like, how about pizza? And she was like, no. And he was like, how about Chinese? And she was like, no, I don't want that either. And after about a hundred suggestions, they died in the hearse. Holy crap, guys. All right, we are in Wisconsin. I have never been in Wisconsin before, especially in a place like this where I can't even pronounce the name, but there is a Spirit Halloween right behind us. We're gonna go in, and let me try to say this. We are in Akanamawak, Wisconsin. That's right, Akanamawak. Tell me if I got it wrong, Akanamawak, Wisconsin. Akanamawak. All right, let's go in and see what they have in Okanomawak, Wisconsin at the awesome Spirit Halloween. What in the world? There is a lock on this door. Will it open? Yes! This actually used to be a Ben Franklin, which is why I chose this location. And look who we have waiting for us, front and center. It is the Possessed Pumpkin, possessed by the soul of Ben Franklin. I hear you. I'll get to you. Are you jealous that I wasn't talking about you? We have possessed pumpkin over here, so I will get back to you. Look how huge possessed pumpkin's head is. I almost bought him yesterday, guys. I can't even remember where I was at, but I was in another store, and I almost bought him because he's so awesome. All right, let's get him going here. You little monsters have been carving up my friends for years. Oh my gosh, I'm in love. Now it's my turn to make a jack-o'-lantern from your head. Oh, I thought he laughed after that one. Okay, let's do it again. Oh, you'll make excellent fertilizer for next year's crop. <laughs> <laughs> If you don't get that, he's actually saying you're a big pile of poop. I really don't appreciate that, Mr. Franklin, but I do appreciate the size of these hands. What the heck? Look at those things. Look how big these hands are. Holy crap, he could just squish your head. I need a skeleton or two for my haunted house. Yours looks just about right. <laughs> I love how loud he is in here. And if you guys don't know, this is actually built on the frame of Crouchy. This guy is enormous, he's like seven feet tall. I don't have Crouchy, but if I found him in a store, I would buy him. Not young Crouchy, the other Crouchy. Okay, I hear you over here begging for attention, Mr. Farquad, Mr. Nostrils. I already talked to you, Mr. Pumpkin. You're just jealous, because you could never measure up to a great leader like Lord Farquad. I love when you look at the setup and they're all just going crazy. Oh, and look, before we go through there, let's go see Monty. All right, Monty, we're coming for you. Give us what you got. He's pretty loud in here. Okay, let's head back over and go through the monster laboratory here. We have the bog zombie going crazy over here already. I love how they have all these animatronics turned up so loud in here today. Okay, let's come over here and get Grim going. All right, I guess we gotta step on it. Here we go, yeah. Dang! He is super loud. Plus he has like some music playing in the background too. I don't recall that the other ones had music playing. I could be wrong, but I don't think so. Oh my gosh, guys, look at what all they have set up over here. All right, we'll come back to that because we have to get Shorty going here first. Wow. 
Wait a minute, what the heck happened to his other glove? I think that's the first time I've ever seen his hand. He's a four-finger man. What the heck? <laughs> I don't even think I ever realized that his gloves can actually come off. What the heck? That is so weird looking. All right, Shorty, we're going to keep on moving here. Let's see if they... Dang! I was really hoping that they would have our balloon butt friend over here. They're still setting up, though, and look at this. This is a whole box of chains of death. All right, the laboratory is making t lots of sounds in here. Look at this. We have a young Crouchy. Yes, what the heck? Look at his hair. Holy crap. He looks like Grandma first thing in the morning. <laughs> I'm sorry, Grandma, forgive me. But what the heck? I think you need to run a comb through that rat nest. We got Barry over here raising heck. And look at this. He's only got one eye. Maybe he read the map wrong with his one eye. All right, we got the bubbles of death going in all four pillars. And we have Jack overlooking it all. Let's leave some stickers for Crouchy. And let's come over and look at what all they have set up here. Look at this, guys. We have a Nozzles. We have a Lucky Bottoms. We have a little Skella Boy. And look at this, we have a Nightcrawler set up over here. This is what I love. Wait a minute, what the heck? It's a dog's head on a stick. Oh, I see. Actually, it's Bubba. They're just getting ready to set him up. Okay, that scared me for a minute. No, actually, I love it when these stores take the initiative and they set up stuff in place of other things that just aren't here yet. All right, let's just come back over here and start at the beginning. Hold on now. Let's get Mr. Nazi going. Or not. Okay, maybe it's a foot pedal. Okay, that belongs to Bottomless Joe. How many names have I given this guy? <laughs> Bottomless Joe? What the heck? Where did that even come from? All right, Nazi must just not be set up yet. Let's try it one more time. No, he's not working, but we know what he does. All right, let's move on past Bottomless Joe. And let's come on over here to Lil Skella Boy. I know, I hear you, Lil Skella Boy. Here he comes, okay. I hear you, okay, there he is. Little Scala boy, look at that face. All right. Then we got this guy here, the night crawler. All right, hold on, let me get him going here. Yep, there we go. Night crawler is pretty dang awesome. He's described as being like three and a half feet tall, but he is so much bigger than you would ever expect. I mean, that three and a half feet is like right here, but they're not talking about the entire giant body. All right, let's get Jumping Jack going here. Here we go. Come on now. There he is. Good job. And then we have Reagan back here. See if we can get her going. I hear her. Man, is she ugly. All right, give us a head spin. There you go. Ugh. And then there's the uh, reflection back there. All right, let's go through the tunnel of electrocution. Is it gonna get us? All right, the floor is not buzzing yet. Okay, they must still be setting this up because nothing's working in here, except for the sound. I don't even know where it's coming from, but it's so loud. Okay, let's come on back out of here because I did see a whole bunch of animatronics on the floor for sale. Stickers for Possessed Pumpkin here before I forget. And stickers for Lord Farquad. All right, let's come over here and check this out, guys. Where are those ones that I saw? I think they're right around the corner. Yes, here we go. We have a Nozzles right on top. We have a Bog Zombie on the bottom. We have the Nightcrawler. And then we have two Fogging Skull Piles. We have a Lucky Bottoms and a Monty. We have two sitting scarecrows, a stuffed dummy prop. Oh look, we got a Shorty. I don't think I've seen Shorty in any stores this season. I mean for sale, like I've seen him set up as an animatronic, but I don't think I've seen him for sale anywhere. And then look at this, we have a Bag of Bones. We have a Reagan. We have two man's possessed friends, a young Crouchy and a possessed pumpkin. I love this guy. He's so enormous. And wait a minute. Look at this right back here, guys. They actually have the inflatable hearse set up. This thing looks totally awesome. It's so much bigger 
than I actually expected it to be. Look at the look of the face on these skeletons. I'll tell you exactly what's going on in that picture right there. That's a man and his wife. And he said, what do you want to eat? And she was like, I don't care, I'll take anything. And he was like, how about pizza? And she was like, no. And he was like, how about Chinese? And she was like, no, I don't want that either. And after about a hundred suggestions, they died in the hearse. And the kid in the back was just like, I just want something to eat. Yeah, don't try to tell me any different. I know that's exactly what happened right there. All right, let's head back here for a minute because I see they do have a couple dolls. The Eerie Emma Haunted Doll. Look at that. Her eyes look like they're glowing already. And we have Decrepit Donna with the glowing eyes as well. And we have my favorite foam cats. Look at these guys. I love how these guys are just creeping along and these guys are like, get out. <sighs> Cracked Skull Zombie Breaker. I think we've seen this before, but how cool is that? Look at that, he lights up green. Is he supposed to make sounds? I don't hear any sounds. They have lots of inflatables here, pretty much everything we've seen in the other stores. They also have the Decaying Zombie Ground Breaker. The Burning Skull Pathway Markers. They have the Jack-O-Lantern Pathway Markers. I love those, look. They're up so high, I can't give you a good look. Oh, look at this, we got a hanging phantom ghost who just randomly started yelling at us because I wasn't paying attention to her. I'm sorry, miss. We have the devil and the vampire door knockers. Ooh, this one's working. Use caution in entering this home. It's almost feeding time for me. <laughs> <laughs> I love that guy, he's so cool. Lots of skulls, and I would love to get one of these. I think I said this before. I would love to get one of these and use it for cereal. $20. That is awesome. Awesome cereal bowl. Halloween cereal. Whoa, look at this one who has the brains out. Chilled brains for dinner. Then we have this guy who has pure white teeth. And this guy who needs the Aquafresh. And this guy who straight up needs some dentures. Ooh, we have the babies over here. And yes, we have two burrito babies. Or are they burrito baby bats? Don't worry, babies. Someone will adopt you soon. And look at this. Under this ginormous pumpkin scarecrow guy, I see something else I've never seen in here before. It's a spirit pumpkin light. Ooh, it's got to try me. Okay, it's not doing anything when I hit the try me, but I bet he just lights up. I don't know if he makes sounds, but you can see there is a light in there. That is awesome. He's wearing some kind of a golden hat, too. What the heck? Wait a minute. He's a light that hangs from your front door. That is awesome. How much is that? 27 bucks. That is totally awesome. And wait a minute. Look at this pet graveyard tombstone. I've never seen this before either. It's a skull of a pet. Sorry, pet. Wait a minute, this place truly is haunted. I just walked back through here and the floor is working now and the electrifiers. Okay, now they stopped working. Now they're working again. They're electrifying my face. Every time I walk through, they stop. I guess they don't want to electrify my face. All right, let's come back through here. Go on over to this side of the store because we haven't seen anything over here yet except for Monty way at the front there. They do have some awesome Chucky's Good Guy dolls, and they have some Annabelle's, and they have this new Chucky doll that has started to show up in stores. He's talking, he moves, he tries to cut himself out of the box with that knife. Let's leave some stickers for Chucky. Oh, look at this, guys. They have Ghostface, they have Gremlins, they have the Michael Myers. He's kind of hard to find in these stores. And they have the Leatherface. They only have one of these, and they have two Michael Myers. That's kind of strange. These are the three sidesteppers I'm seeing most in these stores this year, guys. Sam and Frankenstein and Billy Butcherson. I cannot believe what I just found. Look at this. It's the shirt that nobody can find. The ghost face on the spirit logo. Holy crap, they have one, two, three, four, five. They have six of them. Get down here right now to Akanama Walk and get you a Scream Face shirt. What the heck is this biggest size they have is an extra large thing, though? That is an atrocity. I'm a big guy. I need a big shirt. All right, let's take a look here. We have some Michael Myers stuff. We don't have much Scream stuff. I'm getting very disappointed waiting for the Scream stuff. Let's leave some stickers for Uncle Monty while we're here. 
All right, we got Mr. Hanging Sam here. Look at his chainsaw. I don't know if I've seen these before. The blade says, have a nice day. How could you have a nice day if someone's running after you with this? Look at this, guys. I couldn't find it earlier when Jamiroquai was playing overhead. But here's the Napoleon Dynamite costume. This is a pretty huge store, guys. Look at this place. What the heck, guys? I walked right past this. I don't think I've seen this before. It's the Mr. Potato Head inflatable costume. And look, we got Woody and we got Jessie. Her name is Jessie, the yodeling cowgirl, little yodeloo chief. Whoa, they got the crusty crab jacket too. How cool is that? The pizza for you and me. Look, it's got Mr. Krabs on the back and a delicious slice of pizza. All right, guys, that's it for Akanama Walk Spirit Halloween. I'm so glad we're starting to see more and more things in these stores. It gets more interesting as the season goes because they get more and more and more deliveries. So stay tuned. God only knows where we're going next. <laughs>